Hi, I'm Kelly Flores and these are the Big Picture Talks. Today I want to talk about some of the experiences I'm having making these videos and um, doing these Big Picture Talks. It's, uh, it's been a mix of experiences so far, but this week I kind of hit a wall. When I went to record, um, or went to tape, a couple of days in a row, I just, I had nothing. I went, you know, I just was drawn a blank, nothing. And so my intuition was telling me, then don't do it. Because, you know, you got nothing for it. Not that I don't have a lot of things to talk about. There's millions of things to talk about. But it was that, um, I just didn't have the feeling for it. I sat down and it was just blank. So I had to step back and look at it because when I didn't feel like I had, you know, when I didn't feel like I could do it, when I didn't feel like I had anything to say, um, I started to panic. And I started to feel like, oh, I'm not going to get it done in time for this week, you know. I start work this week and I have all this scheduling and all this stuff and I started to um, feel a lot of pressure about it. And I talked to John and I talked to Destiny about it and they told, they both said the same thing to me. They're, they were both telling me, don't make this into a job, you know. And, you know, remember what it's about. Remember to have fun with it. Remember, this is fun. The big picture talking is fun. And this is what I like to do and uh, enjoy doing. And also to remember that I'm benefiting from this. And I am benef benefiting from this. And I want to share that with you. It's a strange thing to... Um, sit down like this and just open up and talk because first of all I usually do have a subject in mind that I'm going to talk about or a question but I, it's unscripted and so and you can probably tell by the editing sometimes but um, it's unscripted so it's just kind of a flow of consciousness because I want to just see what just comes out without me you know trying to say something and when I feel like I'm trying to say something I can feel that I've, you know, gone off track or I'm, I'm barking up the wrong tree, <clears throat> so to speak, or taking the wrong path. I can see myself get lost. I can also see myself, you know, stay on the trail and, and keep following because a lot of times some of the stuff I'm saying on here are things that I'm, I'm hearing for the first time too, that I'm receiving for the first time as in that's new information for me too. Some things I'm saying I know I've been saying for a long time and if you know me you know I've been saying some of this stuff for a really long time. But the interesting effect on me is um, I can read it in journals or books or whatever. I can read my words and that that has a definite effect on me probably more than I know. But there's been a very interesting effect um, happening with me watching these videotapes. This is one of the experiences I'm having with it. When I sit down to watch, it's almost like I'm watching a completely different part of me. And it's a part of me that's in touch with more than I seem to be conscious of myself. So I really am watching, you know, and listening like an audience member and so it, it's almost a completely different persona that I, I feel like I'm in two different places at once, you know, like I'm two different people. But I associate more with my physical self, you know, my the part of me that's watching the material and also especially the stuff that I'm saying for the first time and going, oh, wow. But the point I really want to get to is for the first time in my life that I can really remember um, the things that I've been trying to get through to myself, that I've been saying to myself, are actually coming up at really good times, right when I need them, like in real life situations where I uh, maybe feel pressured or I 
feel a sense of discouragement, you know, or sorrow or or something that I don't want to feel or indulge in. Since I've been doing these tapes and watching them, I can it's weird. I hear my I hear my it's my own voice, my mental voice, but it's also my voice from the tapes saying, "Oh, well, you know, you're feeling a sense of struggle. Is it that kind of struggle that you you know, just means you're still working on a skill, or are you fighting against something? I mean, I actually used that the other day, and it was so cool, it calmed me down right away, because I realized instantly, oh, I'm working on a skill. I'm still working on the skill. I'm still practicing um, probably like a really beginner level of focusing my attention and really being in charge of that. This is the most conscious I've ever been of it in my life, but what I want to really stress here is that, you know, if you have a camera and you have a way of taping yourself, even a phone camera, and you can just tape little parts of yourself, it is very interesting to listen to yourself, especially if you're sort of, you know, um, doing this sort of going down these mental pathways or giving advice, especially if we're giving advice, you know, I've been known for a long time that a lot of the advice I give is what I need to hear. I always have self-reflected, but this is different. This is really different. I really recommend that you tape yourself and watch yourself. You don't have to post it on YouTube. Or maybe you're going to say something really cool someday and you're like, I want to put that on YouTube or something, you know. But the main benefit is to get to be these two different people. The the one who's spontaneously receiving this information, you know, from the universe and just how we blurt these cool things out sometimes when we're what they call open to the spirit. And um, to have that recorded and to be able to, especially in a time where maybe you are feeling kind of down or you need some encouragement, to have your own self tell you these things is really awesome. This has been a really experience for me and uh, it's really really difficult to describe I just recommend you do it with all the recording devices that exist nowadays it's pretty easy probably some people are doing it all already in some ways but I'm saying consciously do it sit down and talk to yourself about one of the big questions you have about life and you know and see even if it starts with a detailed question about your personal life, like, how am I going to get a job, you know? Sit down and talk to yourself and go into the big picture with that and watch yourself do it. I recommend it. It is a trip. It's a trip.